Hi, I'm Bob from Plastic Pipe Shop TV. Before you order your pipe and fittings, are you really sure of your pipe sizes? We often have people who are fairly new to the industrial plastic pipe systems ordering the wrong thing, which works out frustrating and expensive for them and also for us. Because you want to get on with the job and we want to supply you with the right thing first time. In the world of industrial PVC pipe, especially with inch and imperial sizes, all is not what it seems. Pipe is measured on the outside diameter. No rigid pipe system is measured on the inside diameter. So get your vernier gauges out or your tape measure and measure the outside diameter of the pipe. If you're measuring with a tape measure, some of the metric and imperial pipe sizes are very close to each other, within about one and a half millimetres. So I always like to carry a little cloth tape measure, the kind you use for dressmaking, and wrap it round the pipe and take the diameter of the pipe and then divide that by 3.14. You'll get a much more accurate measurement of the outside diameter of the pipe using that method. The main problems come with inch or imperial sizes. <coughs> inch pipe doesn't measure the stated size. For example, a one inch pipe doesn't measure 25.4 millimetres. It measures 33.4 millimetres. And a one and a half inch pipe doesn't measure 38.1 millimetres, as you'd expect. It measures 48.3 millimetres, a whole 10 millimetres bigger. So a common error is to measure the pipe at one inch and assume that a one inch pipe must be a 25 millimetre pipe. And so you order 25 millimetre pipe and then find it doesn't fit. If you measure a pipe at one inch, it's either three quarter inch, which actually measures 26.7 millimetres, or it's a metric pipe that measures 25 millimetres. To add to the confusion, many pipe fittings are marked with both metric and inch sizes on them. For example, 50 millimetres and one and a half inches. This doesn't mean it'll fit 50 millimetre pipe and one and a half inch pipe. It means it'll fit one or the other, not both. The manufacturers of the fittings use the same moulds to produce the same fitting and vary the dimensions slightly on the mould whether they're producing the metric one or the imperial one. Unfortunately, what they don't bother to change is the writing on the fitting itself. So it can be very confusing. So, measure your pipe accurately. Measure the outside diameter of the pipe, not the inside diameter of the pipe. You can measure the inside diameter of pipe fittings, but make sure you measure them deep in the fitting so you're not measuring the curve as it goes into the fitting. And don't believe what it says on the fittings. Then, once you've got your measurement, use the tables on our website to make sure that you're ordering the right size of pipe. If you're still confused, feel free to call us on 01786 472 850 and we'll do all we can to help you. Thanks for watching. Bye.